I found two remote jobs that are hiring right now. The first one, you'll process orders, assist the sales department, and do a whole bunch of data entry. The second one, you will process medical claims. You don't need any experience. It's a non-phone job, and they'll train you. So if they sound good to you, let's jump right into them. The first one comes to us from the company GitHub. And right now they have an opening for a sales support coordinator. This is a full-time remote position. You can do this job anywhere within the United States. And like I always do, I'm gonna scroll down to show you how much they pay. And I am pleasantly surprised because they're gonna pay anywhere from $21.64 up to $57.46 per hour. Of course, that depends on your experience. And the more experience you have, the more money you're gonna make. But they're really not asking for a whole lot of experience. I'll get into that in just a minute. So GitHub is looking for a motivated individual that can help support the company's growing inside sales and field sales teams. In addition to performing administrative tasks alongside the company's sales representatives, you'll help with business and sales operation projects that define and improve the processes and tools. So in other words, you'll provide support and respond to inquiries from the global sales team on sales processes, tools, and general sales activities, ensure the integrity of customer information maintained in the systems, including salesforce.com and github.com. You'll process purchase orders in relevant internal systems and forward them for final review and invoicing, provision software licenses for trials and activated contracts. You'll also identify ways to increase sales and operational efficiency and contribute to and work with sales operation team on other special projects including training, documentation, and sales reporting. So they're looking for someone who has about two years experience in sales operations, project management, analytics, compensation sales performance analytics, finance or business analytics, process improvement, business development, consulting, finance, marketing, or a related field, or equivalent experience, as well as experience working with data entry or data management systems. So that's really cool. They have a lot of options as far as related work experience. And they list some preferred qualifications, and these are just preferred, they're not required. So they prefer you have experience using Salesforce.com and or CPQ tool. You have experience working in the software or tech industry supporting a revenue organization. You're able to analyze data and influence decision making for business leaders and drive process improvement. And you have strong organizational and documentation skills with the ability to work autonomously in a remote environment. And all those are just preferred, they're not required. But I'm thinking that last one is probably more of a required qualification. So if you like this easy sales support order processing position that pays between $21.64 and $57.46 per hour, you can find the direct link in the description area below this video. Just look for job number one. Our second job comes to us from the company Multiplan. They're looking for a data support associate. This is a full-time remote position. You can do it anywhere within the United States. However, it is a temporary position, and I have no idea how long this job is gonna last. I have no idea when it starts, when it ends, but I do think they are hiring multiple people for this position. And this job was posted November 18th, 2024, a few weeks ago, but this job is still available. This company removes jobs from their careers page, and because this one is still on the careers page, it tells me it's still open. They're gonna pay you $16 per hour, and they're gonna train you. They provide a 10-day training class. New employees would need to work from 8 a.m. to 4.30 p.m. Central Time during the training. And after training, you can pick your schedule anytime between 7 a.m. and 4.30 p.m. Central Time. And you don't have to live in the Central Time Zone, just translate your local hours to those hours. So on a regular basis, you'll evaluate and research claims, coordinate documentation, and determine next steps using various systems. You'll perform timely data entry while maintaining production and quality standards, and perform claim entry and adjustments on medical claims. And you'll do all that while ensuring compliance with HIPAA regulations and requirements and demonstrating the company's core competencies and values held within. So they're not requiring any related experience. They want you to have a high school diploma or equivalent, and you're able to efficiently use a computer, keyboard, and quickly navigate software applications. You have high-speed internet access, a quiet, distraction-free workspace, and they expect you to have regular and consistent attendance and adherence to work schedule. You have data entry, EOB, EOP, and claim knowledge, knowledge of medical insurance terminology. And if you don't have that knowledge, I'll put a link in the description area below this video to a really good free resource where you can pick up medical terminology. They also want you to have Excel experience. You're a good communicator. You're able to work without frequent supervision. You're also able to maintain confidentiality in all required situations. And you're able to use software, hardware, and peripherals related to job responsibilities. So this is an easy get your foot in the door processing medical claims kind of job and they're going to train you. If you like this one you can find the direct link below. This is job number two. 
Alrighty, there you go. We just went over two work from home jobs where you're going to be doing quite a bit of data entry. One of them you'll also process orders and the other one you'll also process medical claims. Hopefully one of these jobs works out for you, but if you're looking for something else that doesn't require a whole lot of experience, check out this video right here. As always, thank you so, so much for visiting and I'll meet you on the next job lead.